All right. So welcome, everybody. Uh, good, good evening. Good morning. Good mo morning, everyone. The ladies. Good morning, everyone. Just to give you a heads up, Laurie has been with us for quite some time. He has been working with our uh, VAs before and um, wanted to get another VA or wanted to, uh, you know, find the best fit for him. So, um, yeah, I, I hope these lovely ladies can definitely help you out, Larry. I'm pretty sure of that. So, uh, yeah, please introduce a bit of yourself and your business background, please, so they would know you more. Thank you, Larry. Hey, y'all. My name is Larry Pringle. I'm a certified personal trainer nutritionist. I started this because I was 300 pounds. I was overweight. And it was just a constant struggle for me. And I, it became a passion to me. And I wanted to help a whole lot of people around the world change their life and fitness and nutrition. So I created a company, Perfect Fit, so we could get, reach out and help more people. OK, that's perfect. Thank you so much, Larry. All right, so let's get started. Uh, feel free to ask questions and just mention their name and answer. Thank you, Larry. Thank you. All right. Let's get started. Who wants to get started? Introduce yourself and tell me about yourself. You know, tell me a little bit about, about yourself. Me first, sir. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, Larry. Good. How are you? I'm doing well. How about you? I I'm doing great as well. Thank you for asking. And firstly, Larry. Thank you for giving me this golden opportunity to speak with you. I am Ernesto Senas, 28 years old. I graduate a Bachelor of Science in Business Administration, major in Human Resources. Um, after I graduated college, I have applied and got hired as a data entry analyst for three years in a BPO company, wherein my tasks were to transfer the data into a database. And I have also experienced working as a virtual assistant for two years, where in my tasks were to handle my clients' different social media accounts like Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, YouTube, and part of my tasks are to do engaging, responding some comments, and to do an appointment setting via DM and phone call as well. And I know how to use ClickFunnel to create landing pages and also to use Active Campaign and MailChimp for email marketing and also I love utilizing Canva to edit some posts to look elegant and classy for both images and videos and I know how to use some content scheduler like Buffer or Hootsuite to schedule some postings and I love using Trello board as for data management and I can create events on Facebook, LinkedIn and in Eventbrite and I'm also good in WordPress. In fact, I have a personal web website created and designed through WordPress, and I will give you my link later if you want. And by the way, I check your social media platforms like Facebook, LinkedIn, and website, and I see that you are a personal trainer, nutritionist, and life coach who helps people and educates them on health and nutrition. And I can really relate to your personal experience of being a fat boy because I used to be a fat girl who was bullied because of my body. And which is why I'm trying to lose weight and I'm extremely happy to work with you and because I can connect your audience because I know what it's like to be big or unhealthy and I understand their pain. So if I work with you, I can develop a good connection with your prospects. That's all, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Who wants to go next? Hi, good morning. Can I go next? Yes. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. I am Princess Lupig, 28 years old, a graduate of tourism management. Um, let me just um, share with you my previous job. Uh, my first job is as a marketing staff at a school where I also graduated college. I do market our culinary course, which is that time our first time to um, 
to launch a short course short courses because that school also uh because that school only promote four year courses so i do marketing i do went to different high schools um, conduct or uh, conduct a career orientation give them flyers and somehow um, encourage them to enroll to our school and when i'm at the school facility i am the one who also um entertain those walk-ins who wants to inquire for the course and yeah that's my first job and after that I tried applying for my dream job which is a flight attendant but then I tried uh, many times and um, I only got rejection so since um, hotel year is also a uh, what uh, um hospitality industry i tried uh, i tried to apply as a hotelier i got hired as a receptionist i been a hotelier for more than five years as a receptionist i do lots of phone calls inbound and outbound i also um, answer uh, our guest concerns I also check them in, of course. I'm the one who check them in. I am the one also do the reservation sometimes. Um, I am the one who, po who post um, discounts on our tra online travel agencies like Agoda, Expedia, Hotels.com, and others. And um, I am also the one who... Uh, who also manage their social media accounts. Like my first job, I am also the one who post um, quotes about foods, about cooking, on culinary course. And I also post pictures of our students while, while cooking. I also took those pictures as well and post them on social media. I am the one who also took those pictures. And uh, uh, going back as a res uh, as a receptionist and a reservations officer, yeah, I do love my job as a hotel here. I love talking to different nationalities every day. I love um, listening to their concerns. I love um, I love my job as a hotel here. And after that, uh, since um my heart really belongs to being a flight attendant. I again applied for a flight attendant job and this time I got hired from Oman Airlines but then I got pregnant and they won't allow me to fly and now I, I am now an executive secretary for a um, heavy equipments company. I do buildings. I also uh, post um, about heavy equipments on their social media accounts like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and I also manage their emails. And since I have uh, knowledge on marketing, I try to somehow um, use it to market this, um, this company because it is only a small company and when I got the opportunity to market this because it is only uh, owned by my partner's mom this heavy equipment company when I got an uh how do you call this I got the the I'm sorry I'm just a little bit nervous you're fine you're fine enjoy <laughs> yourself just you express it you're fine <laughs> yeah. When I get the opportunity to, you know, to market this on social media, I also go to different uh, company. We got this one big company. I think, you know, you know, this company, the Hitachi. We got this and also yeah. the Makati development, which is really popular here in the Philippines. We got this uh, because I market it. I go to their offices and until now, if my um, mother-in-law wants, uh, is really busy, she can still count on me on their buildings, on, on that uh, heavy equipment company. <laughs> work 
that's all, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, questions. Um, yes, sir. Are you familiar with lead generating? Yes, sir. I have searched for it. Lead generation is a process of, you know, um, it's a process of um, getting the intention of one potential customer. So I think it is uh, somehow related to my previous job as a marketing staff at a school where I, um, I told early that, uh, er that I told you earlier, I go to different high schools and conduct, um, uh, conduct some career orientation and talk to the students to um to encourage them to enroll to our school okay. sounds good thank you so much you're welcome sir Excuse me. All right. Who's next? <laughs> um, hello. Can you go next? Okay. Hey, you go first, doing? Isabella. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So, hey, Larry. Uh, how are you doing? Hey. I'm doing hey. well. How about you? That's great. Good day. Um, I'd like to introduce myself to you. I am Isabella Diaz. And right now, I'm still studying as a senior high school student. But it's all right because I only attend school twice a week during weekends. So, I'm not really that. And so, yeah, but I'd like to tell you about my experience. Um, my very first job was with a client who's a business coach, and I worked for her as a part-time TA, um, that's for 20 hours a week. And within this role, I was responsible for email marketing, wherein I send my clients free webinars or ebooks to to uh, prospects through email marketing platforms such as MailChimp. And I was also responsible with calendar management, where I regularly review scheduled meetings and we evaluate priorities and modify previous scheduled appointments. And also my client makes videos about business coaching weekly. And I'm in charge of editing videos, particularly making subtitles, resizing the video to fit perfectly as a Facebook post, since it's being posted on a Facebook page. And lastly, I was in charge for booking for appointments with prospects and customers to initiate in phone calls, just basically keeping my client organized. And then a few months later after that, I went to get on the part-time job, still as a VA to a client with a hair extension business. And my main role was to manage the social media accounts, um, specifically Facebook, Twitter, and also Instagram. And on her Facebook, and I mean, for social media platforms, um, I do daily posting and I do post different content every day. Like, for example, on Mondays, I post blogs and then the next day I post articles, I mean, articles, I'm sorry, and so on. And also, I conduct um, question and answer sessions weekly to gain interactions with customers. And aside from social media management, I was also in charge of editing the photos of the products, um, like uh, removing or changing the background image, adding filters, putting text, or making collage. So that's basically um, all my experiences. And I visited your business website, by the way, and mm -hmm. I think it's good, but I think we can add a little bit more uh, um, improvement on that. So I okay. thought we can help you further improve and elevate your business by engaging more in social media, and I can edit photos or videos to post on your social media. We can take our own photos and also edit our own videos. And since Facebook Reels are in a trend right now, I think we can engage more on that. Um, we can help you make Facebook Reels, like the short videos on Facebook you can scroll through. Since I myself enjoy watching it a lot, and I have observed that a lot of people are into it recently. And I think it's a good way to promote your business. Like we can do, for example, we can do videos of um, 15, uh, 15 second, uh, you know, workout, short workout, exercise, that, uh, just for example. 
and I think it's a very effective way to promote your business. So yeah, I think that's it. Thank you so much, Larry. Thank you so much. All right. All right. All right. Who's next? Me, Larry. <laughs> the the last but not the <laughs> least. <laughs> okay, hello, Larry. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. By the way, my name is May Claire Rojas Enshong, and I am a licensed professional teacher here in the Philippines, and at the same time, a certified ESL teacher. I've been working in quantum for almost six months, uh, seven months, actually. I got my maternity leave, so I had, um, you know, um, take good care of my health and also my baby so finally I'm back now so this is my first interview <laughs> for yeah being back in quantum and then uh, I also have an experience in BPO working um, as a brand ambassador yes a call center agent um, in one of the famous um, telecommunication here in the Philippines, which is the uh, Teleperformance Philippines. And uh, my potential is, of course, social media marketing. So I usually create content um, using Canva, um, posting videos, um, photos in any um, forms of social media um, accounts like Facebook, um, IG, YouTube, LinkedIn. Um, yeah, I also um, navigating, managing the social media account of my my clients, my previous clients before. And yeah, I'm glad that my clients before is also a fitness coach. Um, yeah, <laughs> and uh, yes, and also email marketing. So we usually um, use Mailchimp. So if we have book messages, like if we want to notify our clients, so we we use uh, Mailchimp to um to to notify them if ever we have new webinar, we have new um new things to. Um, to offer to our client, yeah. And then appointment setting also, we do that. Like if we, um, if we have, uh, pers uh, yeah, prospecting clients, if we got, we book client, then we appointment them to your availability. So um, yeah, so that's it. So um, yeah, I'm so happy and I would love to um, work with you, Larry, if ever I'll be choosing this interview. Yeah, that's all. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I have a question for all of y'all. I'll go down the list. And I got a question. Um, whoever wants to start first, we'll go down the line. What's your definition of team? Let me try. <laughs> okay. Yes, that's why. Um, I can really define um, team as you know a family. Yeah, we will work together. We will not. We will not live behind. Just uh, yeah. Just what I'm experiencing in quantum. Like we are family. If you are, um, if you are luck to this, then we will help each other. Um, do not do not let anyone. Um, what is this? Um, um, let anyone still on the you know the level so you have to pull that someone yeah and if you don't know something like you have to you have to ask you have to help you have to 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 learn like that so yeah that's a team that, that's a team that's a, it, I, I, I can define it as a family we have to work together because if you don't have a teamwork then you know of course you cannot achieve your goal you cannot achieve the goal of your client so yeah that's my that's my definition of a team a family we are helping each other to lift up yeah to achieve our goal our me, awesome awesome 
Okay. And for me, sir, Larry, a, a team is a group of people with different skills and different tasks and work together in a common project, service, or goal with functions and mutual support. That is a team for me. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, nice. So Larry, um, a team for me is sharing the same vision, the same goals, not specifically the same skills, but we can work on that. Like we have different skills, we can combine it together, contribute together, and help each other grow. So a team works um, as one, just like a family. That's it. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, yes, for me, as uh, so what Miss May Claire said, uh, team for me is like a family that um, we need to uh, we need to do things together and uh, don't let others down. That's it, sir. Awesome. Thank you. Thank you. Uh... All right. I think I have what I need. I'm going to need Miss Nomi. Hey, uh, sorry. Are we all set? We all set, Miss Nomi. Um, I will let you know something by later today, maybe in the next hour or two, and and I'll let you know who I select. <laughs> okay, no worries. All right, just go ahead and announce it on the mastermind group chat, okay? So I sure we will. who you wanted to work with. So thank you, ladies, um, for joining us today. Thank you, Larry. Thank you, ladies. Thank you, Larry. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye-bye.